Owners of several Aberdeen nightclubs have called on the city's licensing board to reverse a decision allowing pubs to stay open until 3am. The Aberdeen Licensed Trade Association say the move could force late night venues to close. Ben Phillip has more. Heading to a nightclub after the pub closes is a popular choice for many revellers. However, under new agreed licensing being introduced, some pubs will be able to stay open just as long as nightclubs. Venues will be able to apply for a closing extension without a requirement to provide special entertainment. However, members of the Aberdeen Licensed Trade Association, including Attic, Club Tropicana and the Tunnels, are calling for the move to be reversed. My main concern is um, you know, if the bars are open later, people are just going to sit in bars longer and the people putting on kind of good entertainment, like ourselves, uh, are going to feel the people not coming down. The footfall, we, really, we do rely on that kind of one o'clock in a rush. Up until now, pubs like this had to close at 1am on a Friday and a Saturday. But under new approved changes to licensing, publicans will be able to apply to stay open until 3 o'clock in the morning. I don't think it's going to ruin anyone's business because like, I know no. a lot of people that prefer clubs over the pubs. Yeah. So like, I think it's going to be like healthy competition. I'd rather sit in a pub personally than a club and I think it's, it's better for the pubs if I'm honest with you. Pubs are just as fun as clubs so I don't really see it'll make any difference. In a letter to the City Council's licensing board, members questioned the approval of the scheme and cited it could also lead to increased trouble on the streets. This new policy will allow Aberdeen to diversify its nightlife, diversify its offering in the evening, be it hospitality, leisure or entertainment, and allow us to be an attractive, progressive city centre. The new regulations will be rolled out in the coming weeks and a request for an urgent meeting with the licensing board is to be considered. Ben Phillip. STV News.